All right, so here is the answer for this predictable piece that I composed. And in the description of this video, there is a link to, to see the, the whole stuff because we played it in TV with the students and the singer, saxophone, and all that. Nice arrangement. And here are the guidelines. First, we start with an arpeggio. And then some ornaments, and then, then comes the theme.
that's the idea. Just to you can repeat one section also. Double time the one of, of, of G sharp minor. So now let me play another part just with the you play the accompaniment that I just played before and I will play the theme plus the bridge and then again just theme and bridge to practice it. Let's try. It. One, two, one, two, three, four, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one. Four, one, two, three, 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 four, one
So that's more or less idea. Now, for those who don't know, here the chords are G sharp minor, which is well, you can find the tabs of the description of this video. I will post the tabs for everyone. It's a present. But here you see bar four, finger three on the sixth fret, fifth string, and finger four on the sixth fret, fourth string. Then we have E major, which is finger two on the second fret, fifth string, and finger three on the second fret, fourth string. And finger one on the first fret, third string. Then we have F sharp seven. And F also F sharp suspended. F sharp seven will be bar two, finger three on the fourth fret, fifth string, and finger four on the fourth fret, fourth string. With finger two on the third fret, third string. Then the F sharp suspended will be same chord, bar two, finger three on the fourth fret, fifth string, and finger four on the fourth fret, third string. Right? Then we have the chords of the bridge, the C sharp minor, which is finger two, on the, we play middle four only, maybe fifth, fourth, fifth, and second. Uh, here is finger two on the sec on the fourth fret, fifth string, finger one on the second fret, fourth string, finger three on the fourth fret, third string, and finger four on the fifth fret, second string. And we have F sharp 7, which we mentioned before, but this is bar 2, and finger 2 on the 3rd fret, 3rd string, finger 4 on the 4th fret, 5th string. Then we have B e major, major 7, which is, can be with bar or can be with balance. We play middle 4. We play with bar, we play bar 2, we don't play the 6th string, then we play Finger 3 on the 4th fret, 4th string Finger 2 on the 3rd fret, 3rd string and Finger 4 on the 4th fret, 2nd string Then we have E9 Which will be Finger 2 on the 2nd fret, 5th string Finger 4 on the 4th fret, 4th string and Finger 1 on the 1st fret, 3rd string and Then we have D sharp major First inversion And this chord is Meet the first and fifth strings. Then we play finger two on the third fret, sixth string, finger one on the first fret, fourth string, finger three on the third fret, third string, and finger four on the fourth fret, second string. Right? And then we have this. Which will, you will see there in the tab itself with the finger and everything. And then that's a, the ending part of the bridge, right? From sixth to second, and then from fourth to first. Right? Those are the chords. Now let me play just a little bit of the main arpeggio is low one two one two three four One, two, 
One, two, three, four. Three, 
four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Practice that, and I'll see you next time.